Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Courtney, if you're new here. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing this look, which is just a really quick, minimal amount of product, smoky eye that you can do in like five minutes. So if you'd like to see how I created this look, please continue to watch, like, and subscribe, and let's get started. So the first product that I'm gonna use is Kill the Lights by About Face Beauty. It's a shadow stick. It's nice, like, just a, a, just, I'm just gonna throw it underneath the eye. It dries pretty quickly. It's a self-setting product and once it's on, it's on. So I'm gonna smudge it with my finger while it's still moist. Moist, mm, I like that word. And you can extend it a little bit cause you're gonna be bringing that out to elongate the eye. On the inner membrane, do the same. So it's nice and dark in there. And then throw it all over your lid into your crease. I bring it to about there and then I'll start to smudge it with my finger. You can use a brush as well, but in a pinch, I like to use my finger. And my one eye naturally is a little bit smaller, so I overcompensate and just make that a little bit higher so that when I look in the mirror, they're more even. It builds on itself really nicely too. So you can just keep on going back in and smudging it out, but you do have a limited amount of time. As you're blending it out, it doesn't have to be perfect because you are gonna go over it with another shadow and that's gonna help blend it out for you. Just make sure that this they're the same size. When you're blending it out, you want it to go from darkest to lightest. So just keep on, if you have too much on your finger, just wipe it off and then go back in. That's close enough for now. This color, this is the Ouija palette by Hip Dot. This color is called Whisper and I'm going in with the Prados Beauty brush. It's a nice size brush. It's a, still firm enough to apply the product, but it also blends it out really nicely. It's one of my favorite brushes. Now you can just drag it over the black that you just put down. So I'm concentrating it mainly on the lid and then with what's left on my brush, I'm just gonna keep on going up. And as it just, it blends out any imperfections that you may have, you may have from the, just using the liner. Put up the brush again and just throw it underneath as well. I left a little area open here because now I'm just gonna load up the very tip of that brush and just apply the shadow in that inner corner. So that'll give the illusion that you use more than one color. Yeah, there you go, two products, easy. For my lashes, I'm going in with Drama Bomb by Wilma Beauty. And you just load up lots of lash, top and bottom. I already did my foundation and everything. If you wanna see how I do my foundation, then I do have other videos that you can see where I start from scratch, but it's basically the same thing. So I'm just concentrating on the eyes and lips. Can't see anything. The lip liner that I'm gonna use is from e.l.f. This is called Mauve. And it's got like a triangle, but I'm just gonna use the tip of it like a typical lip pencil. I already have my lips tattooed, but I still go in with liner just to make them a little bit bigger. So I just throw a little bit more on the Cupid's bow, blend that out. A little underneath. Did I have ketchup on me this whole time? A little in the outer corner. Blend that out. Okay, this is such a nice nude for like my skin tone. Now I'm going in with Universal Balm by Fluid Beauty. I love this. I, I love this product, but I also love the company. I love a company that doesn't, uh, it's for everybody. It's not for, it's just for anybody that wants to wear makeup. That's what they cater to. And I just, I'm so here for this because I feel like everybody should wear makeup. Well, everybody should be able to express themselves however they want to. So if it's through makeup, absolutely. Oh, 
I just throw that on. I like it because it's clear. So since I'm doing so much on the eye, I want to keep this a little bit more toned down, but I still like that shine. I'm putting a lot of it on. If you didn't want such a glossy finish, you can just use a little bit and it'll be a little bit more matte. <gasps> such a good balm. Mm. Do a little on my highlight. I have ketchup, whatever. That's it, just a really quick couple product look. Uh, you can do this with different shadows that you have, just like throwing down like a, a good black liner or any like dark colored liner. You can change the shadow um, so that it looks like different shadows. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I list all the products that I use in the description box below. If you tried this look, let me know if you have any other ideas that you'd like to see from me. Again, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.